It was a wound reopened as Agnes Njoki Kabiru narrated in court the events that prior to the death of her only daughter, Sarah Wamboi Kabiru, on the 1st of May 2011. Agnes told the court that all the evidence point to the fact that Dola Otieno, a former journalist and a husband, to her daughter murdered Sarah Wamboi Kabiru in cold blood. And another day, he threatened him with a knife and told her, I'll kill you. When she told me that, I told her, Wamboi, can you move and move fast? This thing we are going to sort out when you are out of that house. She further accused Dola of hiding information from them about Sarah's whereabouts until 7 p.m. on the same day. She told the court that when Dola lost his job, his marriage with Sarah became stormy and that at one point they quarreled, during which Dola threatened to kill her. Agnes then advised the deceased to walk out of the marriage for a while, but her counsel fell on deaf ears. I told her that the danger sign is depressed and I think the best thing you better move so that he sorts out himself. But you see, with two people in love, what can you do? She went on stable to be killed. The hearing continues tomorrow. And in Machakos County, a case which was filed by the business community challenging the new tax rates will now be heard on the 28th of February. The lawyer representing Machakos County government, Wilfred Nyamu, failed to appear in court. Nyamu is said to have been committed with the case involving the impeachment of Embu governor and could not make it to Machakos. Haligan Agade, Scales of Justice.